Hey, hello my happy quilters. Here we are again on a Wednesday. Can you imagine that, a Wednesday? I know, it's my Wednesday, favorite day Wednesday, of the week. Wednesday, Wednesday. All right, so we are so glad you've joined us again at the Marsha and Joy Show here coming to you live from Pine Needles Quilt and Sew in Rochester, Minnesota. And we have a beautiful, balmy day outside today. We do. It feels like spring instead of, I don't know, Minnesota <laughs> weather. You know, we get that bad rap for that cold weather. And then we have days like today, and it's gorgeous. It really is. It is. It's either <laughs> really cold, cold or <laughs> on a balmy day. On a, <laughs> a balmy day. In yeah. January. But I remember back growing up, don't you remember when they used to talk about the January thaw? Right. It's above 32 degrees right I now, know. so maybe that's what's happening. I'm pretty sure there's some people out in shorts and flip-flops. I know on the farm, for those of you that don't know, Tom and I milked. We had um, 625 head of Holstein cattle on our farm with our son and daughter before I bought the quilt store. And I know we looked forward to the January thaw because you <laughs> the can't, other time when you, was, you were waiting to thaw. was frozen. Oh, yeah, goodness. Right. So. Yeah, a little fun fact about us, we mugged three times a day back then. Right. So we're on the quilt shop. For me, when we first we sold the cows and I bought the quilt shop, it was like, oh my goodness, it's five o'clock. I can't, I'm done. You can go home, <laughs> right? Right. Because we would, yeah, we'd just be going out to the barn again. So anyways, I digress. Once again. Well, welcome for joining us anyway. And I was, I've been looking for here. Like, comment, and share for a chance to win a ten dollars certificate to the Pine Needles Quilt Store, and we will draw two randomly, and one will be our trivia winner. So be sure to like, comment, and share, and many of you do, and I appreciate that so very much. Absolutely. And before we get started here, whoa, not beginner quilting. We do have some good beginner quilting classes, though. You had your I, snow jokes. I want to. Even, I'm going to do that. Okay. But I want to remind them about any of the products that we'll be featuring here today, and we've got some good ones. Um, you can um, find them at the, our website, www.pnqs.net, and then you go to shop, and this little, what I put up there, the Wednesday Live Feature Goodies will come up, and you will find everything that we talk about, and we leave them up there until next Wednesday. All right. And Susie repopulates that page again. All right. So yes, yeah, snow jokes. Okay, I'm ready. Snow joke. Snow joke. Alright. How do the mountains stay warm? I don't know. They put on their snow caps. <laughs> snow caps? Well, then out west, when they've received record amounts of snow, they really have their snow caps They on. have them ones with ear flappers and everything, probably. Correct. I think they have the whole bodysuit. Wow. All right. So, the other one is, what did the gingerbread man put on his bed? I don't know. A cookie sheet. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay. I thought maybe icing, because it was this no joke. <laughs> A cookie, cookie sheet. sheet. Okay. Gingerbread man cookie? Yeah, I know. Okay. I we it. have the corner on the corny jokes here. We do have the corner on the corny the jokes. The goofiest, stupidest jokes. <laughs> but I bet you we made you smile, didn't we? Even if <laughs> it was pretty bad. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. That's a slippery slope this week, <laughs> yeah. Right down an ice-covered mountain. <laughs> right. <laughs> and remember to land on your backside because you're less likely to break your bones. And that is your public service announcement for, for this today. this day on Wednesday. Okay. Let's talk about some new fabrics. I would love to. So is this mid-January. Is this mid-January? It is. It's Saturday. actually... On Saturday. It's January 15th, right? Okay. I was going to say we're actually on the backside of mid-January. I just feel like it, but it's not really. I know. It's not. Okay. I'm going to open it up because these are so... Pretty. So these new fabrics, now we have had these for a while, but these this was our Valentine selection. All right, and you know, Marcia, these remind me, when I was a kid, my Grandpa Wally used to always bring us Brock's Conversation Hearts. And he splurged for the ones in the little red Oh, box, Valentine's. The little red Valentine's box. Clear wow. top. And you know, kids today don't really understand what a treat those little chalky things were. We never, had, are. we never had candy. And these remind me of that. They don't have conversations on them, but they remind me of the conversation hearts. They are really, really pretty. All right, so we'll look at these. And they're called Sincerely Yours. Sincerely Yours. So we have got some kind of light colored here, but look at the pretty, pretty hearts. 
know, they look like all those pretty little hearts in that really container. Are. And this is a lovely floral print. Uh, is that a moda dot? Yeah, well, it's, a, it's a grunge I don't think dot. it is grunge though. I think it's oh, just Oh, but it's a, a, it's a moda. Yeah, well, these dots, are all yes. moda. And this fun little tiny print. Some daisies, cone flowers, whatever you want to call them. Here's another one of those dots. These are not grunges, these are print dots. I love this. We have quite a bit of yes, this. Little X's and O's. Yep. And that is my favorite background on this line for yes, uh, the too. back of the quilts. And then we have this is more of a what color pink would you say this is? I gotta turn these around this way. Well, I was gonna say apricot, but they're not really apricot because well, they're down here. Nectar. Is We're going with nectar. Pinky. Blood salmon. Orange, blood salmon. And salmon. There we go. Yep. Colored. Well, that oh, little pretty. basket weave is sweet, isn't that it, Marcia? That is Marcia? really neat. And then some more daisies. This now is more, what did we say this color is called? Blush. No, it's no, not blush. No, we called it, you just had it. You just said it. Blood orange. But I think this, what, okay, nectarine. 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 Kind of that nectarine. color. Yes. Pretty fabrics. And then this one, whoops, this one's coming more into the ready orange. I will tell you on this one, on this line of fabric, it's not the bright, bright reds. It's a no, little different. It's, it's a fresh color it is. I love it, though. And here's some more hearts and daisies. And then we have... <coughs> Orchid. This <coughs> really pretty. Orchid colors. They're not purple. They're not lavender. But they are pretty. And then finally we have some purples, the hearts with all of the colors in it, and the basket weave, the daisy, and that's it. So how many were in this? Twenty? No, 30. There are 30, 30. pieces. 30. So it's sincerely yours. I think what we did there too is we made a fat quarter pack of 15, and I right? think we made, we have this one available I believe. But this one is 15, and I think this just has the darks in it. Right. So not um, not the lights. Not, it's not without the, lights. the lighter ones. But isn't that just or a crazy? taste well, we of half of it? Well, we have a quilt off from we didn't feature color whimsy with this, oh, right? Oh, we do. We'll have right. to bring that well, out. Well, we could. We didn't have enough room. We actually have. Oh, that is we, the whimsy quilt. It is the whimsy quilt. It's hanging in the shop. We'll feature it another day. But we have an overabundance of goodies on our wall behind we'll us today. We'll have to bring that. That is. But the this is kit. the pack for the whimsies. Whimsy. And so also, of course, in fine pine needles fashion, we have the layer cakes. This is the big Valentine conversation heart. No, this is the <laughs> chocolate one. Yeah. This a big is, box of chocolates. Yes, it, and that's a small box of chocolates. This is your little box. And then, of course, we have the jelly roll and the honey bun here. Two right. and a half inch strips and one and a half inch. And then this is the pack of little four treats. little chocolates in a box. That's that a little conversation hearts that came in the cart. But I'm going to have you show the Moda Kelly okay. books. Oh, then. my gosh. These are so cool, aren't they? I'll let they you are. have one. We got book number two and book number one. So these are little... Um, I was going to say recipe books, but they're quilt books, and they it's are all recipes to use fun these. little things to use these with. Right. So this one, let me just you know starburst. This one uses the two and a half inch um, squares, so it uses the little uh, mini charms. So these are pattern ideas for the pre-cuts that Moda puts out. And here's a really can, pretty one for some stars too, out of this number one book. You shouldn't hand me books because I fall right into I know. them. And so even though I've I've paged through this, I just have there's to revisit 13 my projects friends. in each book. And this book. one has eighteen. Oh my gosh, there's thirteen projects, and this is only ten ninety nine. So that's a that's a, a really good well. That's deal. not even a dollar. So if you've pattern. been collecting these, don't exactly know what to do with them. Well, this has forty two delicious two and a half inch squares in every pack. Oh, look at in that! In every pack of this. Yes. Yes. So um, this one's all for two and a half inch squares. Is yours all for yes, two and a half inch squares? Yes, that's what they're all for. Uh, that's why I waited till the end to do that. Uh, and here's a little bag, a really cute little bag. I haven't been reading the sizes. I've just been admiring the so, projects. So, anyways, we have these. These are these we had in the store. I don't know a couple years ago, 
and I decided it was time to bring them back because they're, um, they're really good projects in here. I should have saved the projects we made. So this is the new fabric, sin Sincerely Yours. If you've been saving these little guys and need ideas, we have two new books. These are called Moda Candy, and they are fun. They are fun. All right. We're kind um, of on a sweet tooth roll today, Marcia. So we have other sweet things on the table. We have lots of sweet things. Um, I also want to talk about the, um, the um, Blizzard Sale. This is the end of it. It is, and there's good weather out there. There is. We had a price drop today, so right. just about everything in there is 50 to 75% off. There's still a good amount of kits, and there's lots of fun things. There's some, some nice lot of, jelly rolls and yes, charm squares and in there. And there's a lot of dollar items. We have a right. ton of dollar items in there. Well, we did the last time I looked. So, um, But we've had a steady stream of, of, we have. of happy shoppers in today, right. too. So. Um, I do want to tell you about that, and that's going to go through Saturday. So um, we we are having VIP on Saturday. We're going to talk about that a little later. On Saturday, though, VIP will still be in the classroom, and all the, the things, things will, will be hold. out in the hallway. So we'll have plenty of Unless all of you come out to shop and there's nothing left. Yeah, then, exactly. That's then true. Then it will be easy for me that's to move, right, Marcia? So absolutely. Let's it's all about me, right? <laughs> Let's kidding. talk about these new kits that we have yes. going on. Do you want to so talk about this one first? Can, why don't you do the sewing machine first? Okay. Let's get that out of the way, and I'm going to okay. put it over here. So, oh, I picked it because it matches our fabric behind us. We're kind of featuring um, some of our gently used um, sewing machines these past couple weeks. So the, this one is, it is beautiful. It is. It's a special edition machine. It is the Bernina 830 Red, and it comes with an embroidery module and, of course, the hoops and all that other stuff. It has been through our service department, so it's all ready to be adopted by a new owner. The 830 is no longer made, but we have this price. But the 880 is the 880 very is, similar. Yep. So the technology is still here. It's just a... Um, um, a special edition. Special editions are lim well. Not only is it limited. a special edition, it was a limited edition as well. Anyway, um, this machine uh, has 12 inches of space. It has a jumbo bobbin. It has automatic threading, and it's quite amazing. And one of my favorite things is the built-in the dual feet on the back, mm -hmm. and it just drops down and it helps feed your fabric from front. To back and also the automatic threader it has you can't you um the, the we don't have it powered the bobbin right the bobbin displays itself. itself to you so it's very easy to do there's no bobbin case to have to use so all of our previously loved machines are priced to find a new home but Marsha made it even more attractive by adding a green sticker on them so they're all 25 percent off the already low price and um this one has been well cared for. It's been, it it's been. been a one owner machine, and it's been through our service department for its yearly checkup every year since it was purchased. So it is ready this for is a great. The this is a great buy. And, Marsha, we still have a couple searches left. We do. We have a few searches left. So if that is something you've been thinking about, we have not one. But two L460 Bernina sergers, and they are four thread sergers, and they are one of my favorite uh, sergers. But the new owners, or the owners, previous owners, upgraded to uh, the eight, eight thread or the the big the air uh, threader. Yes, yes, the big air threaders yeah. by Bernina. So it was time for them to step up to the new technology. Four sixties are still in our current line. They are my brand new model. ones. And, um, but these are really a great deal. And again, through this clearance sale, we've got them, we've caught them priced to go anyways, but now we've taken another 25% off of that price during the sale. Right, and so uh, most of our big machines are sold, but we have many surgeries left, and we still have a beautiful baby lock. Um, a little gold. gold. Yep. And I think there's... And today we're actually adding... Out there. We're actually there's adding a 530. A there's a wonderful oh, wow. little 530 out there, and too. And today we're adding in a Bernina 880 Plus that, that, that owner traded into something differently. So yeah. we have some wonderful machines for you, both new and in a previously loved section. Yep. Are you setting that down to the table so we have more room? I am that? going to so that it's not quite so... Um, 
crowded on our table. Here. And I love the thread stand on that machine as well because that really gives you that speedy oh, it's uh, very control nice. when you're embroidering. All right, so we're going to talk about other Valentine stuff that we have here. Okay, I love it. I love it. I know. I heart it. Do you need a? <laughs> Maybe. No. All right, let me get rid of the blizzard sale. So this is called Happy Valentine's 7 Pack. And I'm going to come back and These here. are so stinking cute. These ones. are um, gnomes. I just love oh, them. Thanks to nose. Wouldn't that Aren't make a great cute? pillowcase if you were to pillowcase? Oh, well, that is a cuff. Yes. Well, we we are going to make some. Yep. We are going to make some pillowcases soon here when we get some time. So X and O, kisses and hugs on this one. Beautiful diagonal plaid. Oh, that would be pretty. Here's the little gnomes with the little mail, the little hearts. Happy Valentine's Day. And here is Cupid. No. Uh, Cute. So how many are in this pack? Seven. And these are twenty-four fifty. And Marcia, do, since you have grandkids, do they still make Valentine boxes? I think they do. They do make them. Yes, they do. I know they get Valentines and they give Valentines. Okay. Still. So I didn't know if that was still a thing, but they, these these remind me of that. Aren't they cute? They are cute. Yep. Okay, so those so, are called Happy Valentine's Seven Pack. And plus, we have all of this that we're talking about on yardage. On too. yardage, yep. What so, else would you like to feature next? Well, the next thing, oh, I should have done it all at the same time. Yes, let's feature this quilt that's behind us. Isn't this beautiful? And this quilt is called Together. And it's actually a quilt along right now from Moda. It is. And it is on the blog post. Um, on the blog, you can go to. Sherry McDonald's and all the instructions. You right. can go back and look at them. But the pattern, it's complete pattern. Susie made this. You don't need to do the quilt along. But I absolutely love this. This is our Valentine feature, and this was supposed to be, this particular fabric line, I think was supposed to be out for Breast Cancer Awareness Month back I in know, October. Right? So we kind of just rolled it into our Valentine's. It's beautiful. It, it really is. If you have a a pink lover or someone you know with breast cancer this would be a great kit it concludes absolutely everything you need and it has the, the pattern and the binding and the, the pattern is and extra. there's a lot of background fabric in here I so know look at how much a complete is there. and it will make it just as it is on here so let me tuck that in there so that somebody so it is made it. out of this same fabric line right so it's really yours it's really yes. yours it's really pretty and it's all ready for you to start a quilt. That would be a great girls quilt. Too. It would. It would. It would. So you want to help? Oh, yes. You get to show the next one. Ah. Boy, we're so smart. All those multi quilts. This one. This looks like where your daughter just was. I know. In Costa Rica, right? Yes. Yeah, so all those colorful birds. And shiny. And pretty. You know, I just love those. I'm going to call them macaws and the flamingos. Look at the little kissing flamingos in the middle there. I know. It looks like she fussy cut that one. So this one's Tula Pink Fabrics. Uh, Daydreamer is the name of the line. We haven't had it for too very long. No. I'm not going to take this apart, but <clears throat> Susie made this one as well. And this is a back of <clears throat> 22 fat quarters. And it made the quilt. She had two left over. So you could use them towards your binding. Oh, no, she so used the ombre for the binding. It's really pretty. So, but you need some background fabric as well. And you, they do need some background fabric. And she just used a tone and tone white. Right. Right. And, and it's only a yard and a quarter for that size quilt because most of it's all that gorgeous color. This makes a throw, throw quilt, which is... 59 by 76. But what I love about this picnic quilt, this is Cluck Cluck Sew. So she's always kind of been popular right. here at the store. But you can make a king as well so you can get more fat quarters it's 42 assorted fat quarters to make a king size quilt two and a half yards of um the background, the background. fabric or um there are 22 so you could do half, half yard yards quilts. that's what i would do I would or do, you could do 11 one yards you could whatever you want exactly um but I know there is somebody online that's looking to make this in a king size quilt, but what's really fun about these, I love these. It goes all the way from a crib, 42 by to 31, to a king at 110 by 93. 
And that so, is a scrap busting wonder pattern. It, right there. it is. This is a great pattern. It is. You know, and I love the diagonal plaid type look to it. Um, it looks woven, but it's so not. Picnic by Cluck Cluck Sew and the beautiful Daydreamer. Yep, by, by Tula Pink. Tula Pink. Okay, let's go right on into our curated fat pack because it kind of goes along oh, with this. Oh my goodness. Bit. You know, we were really had a sweet tooth. We thing. really had a sweet tooth this we week, did. Marcia. So this is the curated fat pack. Usually this is $21.99 and it's on sale for you for um, $17.99. This is called Cotton Candy this time. So we have some grunge. That's your grape flavor. That's my grape. This is my cherry. What's this? That blue. Blueberry. Blue ice. Oh, that no, blue, not, don't blue we blueberry down there. Oh, no, we do. I don't it's great. Pink. <laughs> the wonderful pink color. These are these are some grunges and some fabrics, I think, from Wilmington. Um, and then there's the blue slushy. Oh, yeah. And there's the mix, which is really, really pretty. That one's gorgeous. So. That's got pale pink. It's, it got, does. it's got a brighter pink and then it that is. very one really in there. It's really lovely. So anyways, this is Cotton Candy, and this is our featured curated six-pack for this week. All right. For and, you. And you know, Marsha, they go with these two, but they went with the, they go with this fabric line pretty well, some of those, those colors. Yeah. So don't wait on them. them because they we do sell out every different. week. Absolutely. Okay, so we've got Tula Pink, and then we have one more, oh, Crayon. Oh my goodness. This <laughs> is your own box of crayons. This is seriously sweet. So if you like to buy yourself a little Valentine treat, this could be it. This is a crayon. Whoa, whoops. Marsha. You might have to have that one. It has conversation hearts on the front. It does. And then it also has a quilt pattern on the back here that you can make with these. But these are 10, I think, fat quarters. Oh, in so beautiful sweet. crayon well, colors. Well, this, this one right here says it's I'm yours, <laughs> and this one says hug <laughs> me, and this one says my love. So this is Riley. These are Riley Blake fabrics, and there are some solids and some prints in here. Um, you can see the prints are kind of a just a modeled right type look. Oh, there's one there too. And then, so, so it's five solids and five prints. Right. In this beautiful box. So any quilter. Any quilter, including me and you, right, would love to get this instead Absolutely. of candy Absolutely. for Valentine's Day. Well, I'd like the candy too, but if, if I, I had to choose, I'd pick this. Because you know what, you can go buy your own candy. If exactly. You have to. Especially. Or I go to your office and find a stash. Exactly. Don't tell them where the stash lives. <laughs> <laughs> I'll become even more popular. Oh gosh. <laughs> These are so sweet. They really are. And Crazy Love is the name of the pattern on the back here, and yeah. Okay, let's talk about one more quilt that we have behind us. Pull this one down. I gotta get further over here. Oops. Let's hope that all this doesn't come tumbling down. Oh, now that's isn't a different that vibe. It is a different vibe. This isn't candy or Valentine. It's um, just comforting denim. And there's a kit over there. Sweet. Oh, it's got the theme though, Marcia. It's a sweet memories kit. Oh, goodness. Sweet right? Memories Kit, because this is uh, fabric from Andover, and this is Laundry Basket Quilts, Indita Sitar's fabric. Okay, and this is from the book called Sweet Memories by Lavender and Lime, and there are not one, not two, not three, but four different patterns in this book. Exactly, so we use just one of them, but I just like the border, you know, it's different, it's a little offset border, the half square triangles in the borders. It's just really a fun, fun one to make and it really was not hard at all. Right. So it's got it just exactly as it is. We have the fabrics in here to make this and then lovely. Make sure you pick up the book to go with it so you exactly. know how to make I it. I don't think the book is included. It is not included because there are so many and the runners in here. From the book. Yep. yep. And so make sure you pick up the book to go with your fabric. Yep. Fun, fun. And right. then we have one more behind here. Oh, wait, there's more. Hold there on. Let me more. scooch the beauty over here. And we'll pull this one down. And this is a batik quilt. And, and this was the beginning package here. And it's called Finger Paints. 
And there are 48 two and a half inch strips in here. And I believe this is Tonga Batiks. This is Quilt Works. So this is Judy and Judell Niemeyer's collections of what? fabrics. And they put them together um, in one of these strip packs from Timeless Treasures. And then the inspiration for the quilt was this book here, Time Saving Quilts with Two and a Half Inch Strips. So I don't know whether you scrap bust or you buy strips. This book is full of ideas, and we made actually the cover quilt here. There's nine the patterns. It is the cover quilt. No, it isn't. Because well, yes, look, it's it all pieced. These are all pieced inside. Yes. Oh, so it's that. It's, yes, it is. <laughs> okay, so we wanted to show this actually three weeks ago when we couldn't find the pattern. So well, we've sold out of the books. We sold right. out of the books. It so is that one. So yeah, that that that's one. really pretty out of the brighter fabrics. And too. we have these fabrics, I think, even in the store right now. I don't remember the name of them, but we have those we blues do. and greens. Yep. But anyway, the book is amazing. These are gorgeous. Mm -hmm. And together, what a deal. I know. Lots of fun. And this is a pretty good size quilt. It is this a big is book. a. Um, uh, so they have to have some background and a border, two borders actually, to yep, go with. 75 by 87, and they need actually two of these because there's 70 strips. And it's just a little bit of background print, two thirds of a yard and a yard of. This is 48 strips, right? Right. So you need two Or packages. they could buy some yardage and just and make, make some rest. more. Yep. yep. So lots of options. Okay. Did you Dang it! I wanted to bring the Valentine socks in. I forgot. I'll do them next time. Okay. Yes, it's we have so we have time. a we have a one. It's not a onesie. This is a really good deal. Joy and I were saving these because we, we were hoarding. We them. we love them so much. And you can see on the back, it's beautiful coffee, different kinds of coffee fabrics. It's a jelly roll pack. We were gonna have a fun class with it. And right. Alas, Marsha and Joy. Alas, our time. Please. So we decided to let these go at half price. Oh my goodness, Marcia. So those are in there, regularly $44, now just $22. So if you're a coffee lover, I love the colors of the blacks and the reds and the creams and, of course, the coffee color. Right. So we have some of those. That's our kind of our right. bargain basement deal for today. It was. And I know everybody's waiting for the trivia. So, first one to answer the trivia question correctly and at Susie's computer first. Let me tell you about the trivia question. Oh, that was tricky. It, it is. It's it's a it's kind of a informative one. You have to be kind of quick on the draw, though. Okay. Don't they? Because it's. You do. Yep. You'll see when I. Read okay. It. We're ready. But anyway, the you. first one gets a ten dollars certificate. The first one to get to Susie's computer. Great. Okay. So here we go. Trivia. When dating a quilt, such as a 1920s or 30s or 40s area quilt and so forth, which fabric will dictate the period? The oldest fabric in the quilt or the newest fabric in the quilt? The answer is either one or the other, oldest or newest. And of course, my daughter said, why are you dating a quilt? <laughs> why are you dating a quilt? All right. So anyways, when you're looking, when like... Those quilt historians are looking for a certain time when this may right. have been um, made. Created, yep. There, there might be fabrics from a certain era and then another era. Right. Um, and which one would it be? So, 50-50 so, so chance there. All right. Let's talk about the thread subscription. These just came in. Oh, my goodness. These are so pretty. So, if you love Aurifil thread... I'm going to open the box to show and tell in person. And I will tell about. you. Oh, yeah, we have a winner. Oh, yay, yay, yay. The winner is Carrie Woodworth. So congratulations to you, Carrie. You have won. And the answer is the newest fabric. That would mean even if you only had uh, a small amount of fabric, let's say you have grandma's fabrics from her attic from the 1930s, and then you came to the store and bought some 30s like reproduction fabrics. Right. It doesn't count. It has to be whatever the fabric. Oh, yes, I have to get rid of it. It has to be whatever the fabric. Um, <laughs> I just have what? to tell you that there's a pantomime going on. There is. <laughs> I know. Take it down. Okay. I thought 
thought she was cutting us off. Like we talked too long. Okay. Good. Okay. So, anyways, it's the 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 newest fabric that's in there. So even and, if you use ten yards sense. of grandma's fabric from the thirties and one yard, a dated quilt has to be of the newest fabric that's in there. The only exception is in the case of mending. Mm -hmm. If you had one that needed mending and you had to use a reproduction, today's reproduction fabrics to match in there. Or even do something to patch over the exactly. top. Exactly, but if it's actually sewn into the quilt, you have to use the date of the right. newest fabric that's in there. I did not know that. I guessed it wrong, but it makes total sense. Right. Okay, now we'll go back to the thread subscription. All right, so Orifil is offering again this beautiful thread builder collection, mm. and it is so very tempting. So each month you will get three spools of Orifil, and this year's thought process are these beautiful um, botanical things. Mm -hmm. Frankopini may Colors. not have pronounced it correctly is the name of this month's collection for January but throughout the year every month will have a solid thread and then two variegateds to help you build up your collection of threads whether you like to piece with them embellish with them quilt with them or just enjoy them as an artistic uh, measure uh, that is how that is and then Marcia, then you, you get a pattern um, every month you get a pattern no this is, um, you have to order this online only, you know, so if you want it, they can help you in the store to order it, but in order to get the, we're only doing it online, so we right. know, because it's a full subscription for the full year, but it also then, every month you get a pattern, and it's applique to use your threads, and look at all these pieces. Those are, yes, for that, that beautiful Primera. Yes. So on the front here, you can see this plumera. It's for that. So every you'll get 12 floral blocks, and it's it's applique, and then you can stitch them down with, with a blanket stitch or however you want to with those gorgeous threads. Or you can say maybe someday. And wow, I'm going to use these right Well, away. let me tell you this. We just were informed that our fill thread has went up oh, like everything else quite a bit. However. We ordered these before the price and we ordered for the year. So these, this is a much better deal than going and just for each this time. Separately. Yes, just for these, for this collection. Right. So, um, and they're beautiful. You, there's more information. If you click on the spools of thread um, on the page, right. you'll see all the different colors for the year. It's two variegated and one um, solid color of wonderful Orfield thread. Now, I have been using something that I learned long, long time ago you have. from our friend Kay England. What have you been using? She binds with variegated thread because she feels it just melds in a little mm -hmm. bit better because she usually uses some kind of a print uh, on her binding, not a solid mm -hmm. thing. And so using variegated thread, it doesn't really show if you're doing machine binding, hand binding. I like to machine quilt with variegated for the same reason, especially if there's a lot of color. Exactly. But a subtle one is usually what I Exactly. Pick. So it's good for anything. It's right. our favorite one of our favorite threads here and yay. Right. Right. So don't wait to subscribe so you get one each month in your mailbox. Uh, we do ha usually have a couple left for sale inside the store and you can purchase them that way, but you will not get this beautiful gorgeous pattern to go with. Right. And the price is a little and more. And the price is going to be more in the store because Right. Of the uh, increase. But sign up for 12 months of fun. That way, too, threads. We all love threads. Something to look forward to in our exactly. mailbox. Well, I'm going to have you talk about VIP on Saturday. The very important pine cones. The very important pine cones. Because we did tow with maybe not doing it, but. We did. Marcia came in. She says, Joy, have you been watching the COVID cases? Of course we do. We watch every day to see what is happening in our community and what, wondering whether or not our mayor is going to institute a full mask mandate or not. And we decided that uh, many of you, well, essentially our event is sold out. Yeah. And you look forward to coming each month. But we want everyone to and be safe. And we do safe. too. It's very well, we safe. do too. Yes. We're all prepared. We're all psyched. We have those um, gifts with, with um, your attendance, attendance yeah. ready, ready to give to you. And we want you to come. However, we... Um, 
are asking that you wear a mask. It's it's not a in the classroom. In in a classroom because we want everyone to be safe because this new variant seems to be rather persistent and persnickety and and plus we, there's it's not a full to capacity in the classroom, but there are a lot of people in there, and we just want everybody to be safe. So we do ask that you wear a mask in the classroom during the event. Right, and if for some reason you happen to forget your mask, we've got you covered. We do, we've got Literally, some. but we do want you to be here, and again, um, your attendance, if you are here, we have a gift for you to go home, and it's to make... Um, the starter kit for a beautiful right. kit. And just uh, just a reminder, it is for those that come into the event. However, <clears throat> if there is some reason that you can't come in, you have paid $20 to be here. The $20 goes towards that particular kit, so then you would pay the remainder of the price of it, which right. is 40 some dollars. Right. So if you absolutely can't be here, you need to call the shop and tell them, okay, I'll be in to pick up my kit, and then the $20 goes towards the purchase of that kit. Right. But for $20, it's only if you have your little behind in a seat. Right, exactly. All right. So I think the last thing we have now is auction. I know. And today, and we have we're kind of on the table runner thing. Now I just have to make sure. We have two. I know, just making sure they actually belong to us. These, Susie made these. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I had a flashback to, to last year. I know. No, it's not. It's ours. Okay. <laughs> I'm sure Susie made these. All right, so we have two. We have two in the lovely chill fabric from I Moda. Know. So two fun. Uh, matching table runners for you to give as gifts or keep one and give one or keep them both. These are really pretty. Right. So I will have these on the um, web page tomorrow morning and bidding ends at one o'clock on Saturday. So we got some beautiful um, I love runners. It. Look at how little these pieces are. I know. This was, she took her uh, quite a while to make this. So. I know. Little, little tiny. And there's a little. One inch. Tiny, it's not that noticeable there's little flecks of gold in some of this right too. so oh wow they're that's beautiful what we have. okay all right well thank you so very much for joining us again today we're going to button up okay and be done with this for today so some of you um we'll see you on saturday otherwise for the rest of you we'll see you in the store or we'll see you right here next week at one o'clock on our live presentation so until then thank you so much and we will keep you in stitches